Hey guys, so today we're going to be working in my pen pal art journal that I share with Brie from Documented Journey. I'm going to add all her links down below. This is what Brie did. It's beautiful. I really, really love this layout. Shades of Green is just beautiful. Amazing. She's so talented. It's unbearable. Anyways, uh, of course, Brie sent me some goodies and oh my gosh, you guys. I got a bunch of planner stickers. Beautiful, and I can't wait to use them in my planner. She's so sweet. And then she sent me, she let me know that she is not gonna be using her planner next year, and she sent me the pencil board for the Hobonichi and the cover, which was extremely sweet of her. That. She sent me a bunch of little, they're like stickers, you guys. They're like labels. Look at that. Give me two of each. So I don't know, girl, did you get a silhouette or something? Because these are beautiful. And of course, some of her little artwork on sticker paper. Of course, I will definitely be using these girls. They are gorgeous. So thank you so much, Brie. You are the bomb. So I'm gonna put these aside and start working on my page. So last week was Brie's birthday and I decided that I'm going to create a birthday layout for her. All I did was grab these um, book pages and I want to add them to my layout as a background and all I did was add some multimedia and stick my pages down. So I want to add my gesso, but also want to protect Brie's pages. I have a bad habit of getting paint and stuff on Brie's pages, so um, I'm just going to add my gesso. And I'm just doing it very lightly because I still want the book pages to kind of show in the background. And then I'm going to grab my paint and start adding some color to my page. So the only reason why I use my finger and not a brush is because I am lazy and I don't feel like cleaning my brushes afterwards. So I still like how it looks. It's kind of messy and um, all over the place and I like that. I'm just going to grab some yellow paint and add it through my stencil. Now once I'm done with this, I decide I'm going to use my embossing powder. Now, if you guys have been on my channel for a while, you know I don't do it as much because I'm really bad at embossing. But I decided I'm going to use it in my art journaling because it's not supposed to be perfect and um, it's a great place to practice your embossing. So I thought, let's go for it. I'm gonna grab my polka dotted stencil and I'm just gonna go over it with my Versamark. Now this is an easy and fast way to add a print to your layout, um, but as you know, my experience, uh, you really need to wash your stencil really well with some soap and water after you're done because it gets extremely sticky. Anyways, all I'm doing is adding my powder and then I will be grabbing my heat gun and really you can't see it that much, but it looks really pretty in person. That like um, glossy look on the polka dots with the matte paint 
I really like how it turns out. So I'm done with all my embossing. I'm gonna grab my heat gun, finish this up. And then I have this cutout that I got from one of my Flow magazines. It's a party girl and it will work very well with my birthday theme. I'm just gonna grab my multimedium, glue her down. And then I'm gonna go through my alpha stickers and we'll be using some large white alphas for my title. So my alphas wouldn't stick to the embossing, so I'm going to grab my multimedium and make them stick. Um, then I want to add some white splatter, and I actually like how it turned out. It kind of looked like confetti when I added the splatter, and it worked really well with my little party theme. I will also grab my black gelato and add some you know, uh, shading to my girl and my alphas. So I'm gonna grab my white Sharpie, add a border, and a little bit of highlights here and there, just to kind of add some white to my page. But I believe I'm almost done with my layout. I wanted to wish Brie a happy birthday, and you guys need to go and check out her channel. I'm gonna add all her links down below. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you are new to my channel, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up, and I hope to see you guys soon. Bye.